Cinema lovers in Melbourne are celebrating the news that the historic Astor Theatre's future is secure. There had been fears the picture theatre would be redeveloped or closed entirely. But after a long campaign by filmgoers, a passionate buyer has stepped in and he's promising to preserve the venue's unique character. Not much has changed at the Astor Theatre in more than 75 years. And now it seems it won't for a long time either. It will carry on as a cinema. It's the last uh, Art Deco cinema still operating, I think, in Melbourne. Eight-year-old businessman Ralph Taranto has bought the historic building for an undisclosed sum. And that's made Astor regulars very happy. They were worried without a new owner, the cinema would eventually be closed means that we can start seeing our business as something that will grow um, as instead of wondering about our, our finality and the, the final date that would be closing in. So we don't have that fear anymore, which is a great relief. But the previous owner, St Michael's Grammar School, says that was never going to be the case. The vision for it was, uh, was to recreate it so that it could be a flexible performing arts centre that protected uh, the traditional use as a single screen cinema. Nonetheless, many in the community didn't share St Michael's vision and a successful online campaign attracted the support of thousands of people. It's sad that uh, we're no longer pursuing that vision, but as I said, at the end of the day, it's a positive outcome for the Astor. There will be some changes to the Astor, including plaster work and a new veranda, but the business will remain the same and all its little quirks will stay, including the homemade ice creams and resident cat marzipan. It's just bricks and mortar without the, the soul that vibes inside it. So we're really pleased to know that the, that soul of the building can stay cohesively attached to it and can continue into the future. I don't look at it as work, what I'm going to do. I, I get a great I'll get a great pleasure out of it. Cinema goers love a happy ending. Kirsten Vaness, ABC News, Melbourne.